Alright, so today I'm going to show you guys how to wire up a pellet stove to a Google Nest thermostat. It should be the same for all the different Nest thermostats, but it's at least accurate for this one. So the Quadrifier pellet stove that I have, here's the model number for you if you want to look it up. But the problem that I was having is when you wire up the pellet stove as is, just red and white to the red and white on the thermostat it has a low power error and the reason that is is because this produces 17 volts and you need a minimum of 24 to operate that thermostat so the way you solve that and I'll try and put a link down in the description but you have to get one of these power adapters this one's by power expert it worked for me that produces 24 volts so just keep in mind you're adding 17 and 24 when you are done, which this pellet stove didn't blow a fuse or anything, so don't worry about that. But after you run up both sets of wires into the thermostat, it shouldn't matter since it's a little transformer which one goes to common and which one goes to red. But the way that it wires up is obviously the W for white is the white one coming from your pellet stove. R for red coming from your pellet stove. And then for the transformer, what I did is that one comes with markings on one of the wires. I made that one my common. It has a black stripe on one of the wires, so I just decided that one's for common. Shouldn't matter because it's a transformer. But then what you do with the red one, with the other wire, is I just grabbed a pair of needle nose pliers and I wrapped it tight around there. That way it's not gonna go anywhere and it works like a charm now and the way you can test your voltage when you get that on there it'll be a little weird here for a second because i just put it back on and my pellet stove will kick on here for a second probably too but tap on the side here pulls up the menu go down to settings click on that go to the wrench or equipment go to power info and you'll see i'm sitting above 24 volts i'm setting it 34 now. It fluctuates a little bit with whether or not you have the pellet stove on, but that's the way I did it, and simplest way. Hardest part will be just running up that additional sets of wires from the transformer, but other than that, it is pretty simple, and it works like a charm. Right now you can see I'm sitting for the temperature on my thermostat right at 68. This is off because I just plugged it in. It's really about 70 degrees in here, but that's how you do it. It's that simple. Hope this helped you guys because it took me a little while to figure it out myself. All right.